Good morning, Aggies and Buckeyes. This is a short tutorial that will show you how to get onto McGraw Hill, AKA Wonders, to save and submit your work. First, make sure you're in the Cluffer portal. Once you're there, open up McGraw Hill. Next, you'll click Wonders Grade 4, and then it will take you to this screen. Once you're on this screen, if you see a number right here on your to-do list, that means you have assignments assigned for that week. Click there. To do. Once you're there, you're going to come over to your My To-Do List, and you will notice any assignment that your teacher has assigned will be right here. Now, keep in mind, your teacher may not call it weekly assignments. He or she may call it something else. Once you're there, you're going to come over to the actual document itself right here. Open it up by clicking it. Now, once you click on the document, don't be worried if you don't see this screen. Remember, everybody does have a different workbook page. So if you don't see this actual worksheet, you might actually be assigned another one and that's okay. First thing that you're gonna wanna do to type into the document is you're gonna put your name. And to put your name, you're gonna come over to this T. You'll click it and you will come up to the top Place your cursor as close to the line as you can, and then you'll type your name. Don't worry if it's not perfect. Don't worry if it's on top of the line, above the line. As long as it's close, you'll be just fine. Now, if you have to actually type into the page, you'll do the same thing. Now, for this one, it does tell you to use a writer's notebook, so you'll use a writer's notebook. But like I mentioned, if you do not have this worksheet and it looks different, and it actually wants you to write a sentence into the worksheet, you'll do the same thing that you just did to type into the actual worksheet itself. Now, to go to the next page, you're gonna click the arrow over. Now, you'll notice that you can't tell what page you're on right now. So in order to tell what page you're on, you're going to click Zoom Out, and it'll show you the page numbers. Once you're there, you can click the arrow over, and you'll start seeing the page numbers for the assignments. Now, just a quick example, if you are actually typing into the document itself and not using a writer's notebook, Again, you will make sure that you have the typing key turned on and you'll click as close to the line as you possibly can. And then you'll type your sentence here or your answer, whatever you need to put onto the line. Now, once you complete all of your document, you're gonna hit save. Now the save button is this little floppy disk with a pencil. You'll click save once and a little pop-up window will show up and it says save to your assignment and to work in your binder. Once you see that message, you can go ahead and you can X out of the screen. And then you will see your document right here. Now you're not quite done yet. So in order for it to get to your teacher, you'll hit the submit button. Now, if for some reason you don't finish all of your work that day, or maybe you want to go in the next day and check your answers and make some other changes, you can click the same document right here and it'll open up your work. You can make any changes and again, you'll hit save. You'll X out and then you'll hit submit and you'll get a submit confirmation. Click OK and you'll notice it now has a green check. So like I mentioned, if for some reason you don't finish your work or you need to make changes and you already have the green check, you can still click on your document. You can make any changes that you need. Now, if I wanna add my, some more text maybe to my sentence or something, or maybe I forgot to write my number, I can go back in type my number and remember if it's not on the line perfectly, it's okay like that. Click save. You'll wanna X out. And you'll notice there is no other submit button because it's already submitted and your changes have been recorded.
So there's your new change. You're all set to go. Hope that video helps.